Hello everyone, this is Rain with Valor Point, and this is my second video on the Boost to 90. This is now on uh, live servers, so, uh, yeah, I'm going to show you guys how it works and what it does. Uh, so I have my little gnome warrior here, I just got to level 60, um, which should give me the veterans bonus, which gives me maxed out professions. So we can create a new character if you want to do level 1, uh, just boost you to 90. But I want to do my little warrior here. And uh, yeah, so it's going to boost my blacksmithing and engineering, which are the two professions I picked up. Um, and I also heard that if you don't have any professions on your character and they're over level 60, it will pick two random uh, major professions and then first aid. So, um, not sure what, uh, I think I'm going to do protection. I really want to tank on this character. Uh, I pretty much played prop, uh, while leveling, and it was really fun. I enjoyed it a lot. So we'll stick with that. And we will level up. There we go. I am now a level 90 warrior, straight from 60. I have a huge smile on my face right now. I'm so excited. I've used all of my spare time, my free time that I've had for the past like three days to level this character up to 60 from like level 15 or something or 10, somewhere around there. So yeah, I'm really excited. And uh, alright, so I was in Stormwind when I logged off at level 60. So um, it automatically puts you here. Um, at the uh, Shrine of the Seven Stars for Alliance. I'm assuming it puts you at the, the Horde base for your Horde. Um, so let's accept these quests here. And uh, first thing I want to do is go to the Flight Trainer. And see, uh, you can also see I have 366 gold. Um, it added an additional 150 gold to my account. Um, and you can see that I automatically have all the flying the only um the only um training i had before was the ground mount the slow and then the fast ground mount you get at 40 once i hit level 60 i didn't train anything else because you automatically get it so um yeah let's pull up a mount here let's find a cool one Phosphorescent Stone Drake here, my favorite mounts, and there we go, I can fly. Yay! Well, I'll take a look at my professions here. You can see they are maxed out, I just don't have archaeology, fishing, or cooking. Um, but that's okay, those aren't, those aren't, those aren't really that important anyways. Um, and then I think in my mailbox all I have is just the regular, uh, oh. Oh, so it actually mails me my items that I had in my bag. Um, and then, of course, you get the packages, I think, from, uh, like, level 80 and then level 90. So cool, that's, uh, yeah, and then, uh, oh, obviously the, um, gear here we'll zoom in take a closer look at my character and look at the gear that we get here um, so it's all green which you may at first think oh my god that's horrible but it is uh, 483 483 gear which is pretty good um, it's not enchanted I don't think there's even any gem slots so it's of course not gemmed but um yeah I mean that's that's not bad 483 um, I think that's good enough for, yeah, so you can start out with the um, Throne of Thunder, which is cool, it's exciting. Um, so yeah, I definitely will be grinding out some uh, transmog gear on this character, and it actually reset my talents too, which is interesting. Um, although it didn't give me my dual spec, so I will have to go train that. I was curious if it would give me that automatically, but it doesn't. Um, so yeah, that's that's about it. Thanks for watching. If you guys have any questions, please leave them in the comments. I will do my best to answer them. 
and make sure to uh, rate and subscribe to the video if you like or subscribe to our channel if you like the video. Thanks guys. Bye. Thank you.